Hey guys, today I'm going to be filming um, my book closeout haul that I finally got. I ordered this the day after Christmas um, and I just received it yesterday. Again, I'm sorry about the lighting. I really haven't figured out a good a good system yet as far as where to film to get the best lighting. Um, so just bear with me. Hopefully, hopefully it'll adjust and make it a little bit better. I don't even know if this is helping or making it worse. But we'll see. All right. Um, anyways, this is the second half of my, um, my Christmas haul. I used the rest of my Christmas money to place an order with them. So, um, let's get started. All of these books I'm really excited to read. Um, I was really happy with this order, probably more so than the first one. They had a lot of really good books when I placed my second order. So, um, the first book I picked up is I Am Number Four by Pitta Hislor. I'm sure you guys have all heard about this one. Um, they're making a movie about it, and I believe it comes out some point this year, so I'm really excited to read this book. It sounded really interesting, um, so reading this book before it comes out, and I'm sure you guys have all seen this. It says Lorian Legacies on the side, and as you flip it, you can kind of kind of see it on the pages. So, yeah. So there is that. I am number four. I also picked up Beautiful Creatures by... Kimmy Garcia and Margaret Stoll, um, another book I'm sure you guys have all heard about, but I haven't read yet, so I picked up this one. Again, it's really pretty. I like the cover a lot. I'm sure you guys have all seen it, though. Yeah, so there's that. Um, this next book I haven't really seen anybody on YouTube talking about, but I absolutely love Sex in the City. Um, so I was so excited to see this book on there. Um, because I really, really wanted this. I've read Sex and the City by her. I've read Trading Up. I've read Lipstick, Jungle. Um, and this is the new one. And they are making a movie based off this. This one's The Carrie Diaries. It has that, like, rubbery feel. And I'm going to be reading this probably next for the Chiclet Challenge that I'm doing. Um, and yeah, it just says CB for Candace Bushnell. And it's pink on the side. But yeah, I'm really excited about this one. And I love the, this new, like, rubbery feel. And you know what is so funny? Me and my best friend were talking about how if they did a third movie, it should be before, like, all of them before they got to the city. And this is what this book's about. Me, Carrie, before Sex in the City. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I also picked up The Missing Girl by Norma Fox Mazur. Um, it says, author, author of the Newberry Honor book, After the Rain, which I have read After the Rain, um, I used to read her a lot in high school, um, and this book sounded really good. It's a psychological thriller, and I love those, so, um, yeah. It just says, this is the story of five sisters, Beauty, Mim, Stevie, Fancy, and Autumn, and the man who watches them. So, it sounded really good, so, looking forward to reading that. I also, this is one of the books I haven't really heard anything about, but once again, it's something I could read for the Chiclet Challenge, and I think it was only $1.99. Um, Secrets of My Hollywood Life by Jen Colanita. And I think Jessica of um, Beauty Equals Hate had this book. I'm not sure. I believe she did, though. Okay. I also picked up Before I Fall by Lauren Oliver, another book I had on my Christmas list that I didn't get. So I was happy to see it on there. I'm sure you guys all know about this book. So there's that. Oh my gosh, my pile's getting huge. It's going to fall. Um, another book that I was really, really looking forward to is The Body Finder by Kimberly, Kimberly Dirt, Dirtling, Dirting, Dirting, sorry. Um, and this is actually an autographed copy. There's her little signature right there. And I paid a little bit extra. It was like $8.50, I think, on book closeouts to get the autographed version, but I only have one other autographed book, so I thought that was kind of cool. So I'm looking forward to reading this as well. Okay, I also picked up Wicked Lovely. The first time I picked up the second book, um, because it was really cheap, and the, they finally, yeah, I picked up Ink Exchange the first time, but then this they had this one on there. I think it was only like $2.99, so I picked up the first one. It's a lot smaller than I thought it would be. I mean, I'm sure you guys have all seen this before, but for some reason I thought it was a lot bigger. Okay, I also picked up... I am furniture, or because I am furniture by Thalia Shal Shaltus. Shaltus. 
um, Karen, OCD of Books, and Krista of Cubicle Blindness, they both picked up this book, and it sounded really, really good. And I didn't know until then, but it's actually written in verse. So this is going to be a really, really quick read. Um, but I'm looking forward to that. And it kind of, it feels really cool. Like, it's like, um, you almost, you could feel the outline of the girl. I don't know. I like it. It's pretty different. Okay, and the last book I got was another book that Karen has that I saw, and I think Jessica also had this, this one, and it's Skinny by E.B. Kaslick. Um, do you ever, do you ever get hungry, too hungry to eat? I believe this is about, yeah, it's about a girl that has anorexia, so it sounded really interesting. Again, it looks like, well, the words are pretty small, but it looks like a pretty quick, quick read. So yes, that's it. That's my book closeout haul. It's big. I'm probably not going to be doing hauls for a while, um, just because I really need to catch up on what I'm reading now. Um, actually, I also signed up for NetGalley too, so I have um, Here Lies Bridget that I have to read, which I think I'm going to read next. Um, and then I also have Shine by Lauren Miracle that I have to read that I got approved for. So, and right now I'm reading After by Amy Efa, and I love this book. It's so good. So, um, that's it. I still have a couple more videos to make. I might film them today or tomorrow, but I will let you know, and I'll see you soon. Until then, happy reading.